Hey guys, Crew of Blind Wave back. I am Calvin. I'm Aaron. Rick. And we are back with another trailer from the Game Awards. This time, Elden Ring. Ah. This is one that we've seen a, a teaser from before. We've seen a little bit. Yeah. It looks kind of like a, a Elder Scrolls, Dark Souls kind yeah. of. Dark like Souls. a first person Hybrid kind of thing. Mm -hmm. A little so. more open world. Mm -hmm. Very anticipated. A lot of and people I think are excited it was, for this one. Uh, multiplayer as well. Was that the one that I'm thinking of? I don't think so. I mean, not that I've seen yet. Demon Slayer has multiplayer, but it's not like the focus. Skyrim has multiplayer. Demon Souls, now, but that's not. What I say? Demon Slayer. Demon Souls. Demon Souls. Okay, yeah. yeah. It has like that ghost aspect in that one, right? Yeah. Where like you can bring someone in, but you can't really. You're not like talking with them and stuff. Yeah. There's not a lot of communication, so right. there is some elements. But uh, no, I have played uh, Dark Souls. I played over at twitch.tv slash blindwave. You yes. follow that, I'll, I got to play more of them. I've only really played Dark Souls 1 and a little bit of Demon Souls. So, um, And you can find it over on the Blindwave Twitch archive channel. So find all that stuff over there. But Same uh, with me, but you can't find my playthroughs. Because you can't see them. They were amazing. I had no trouble whatsoever. They were. <laughs> he one-shot every boss. Yep. Yep. It's like we're going to one-shot all these bosses. Let's see what we have. Peggy AG. Vampire. It happened an age ago. But when I recall, I see it true. It's got some grayscale. <laughs> She have four arms? Four arms so and they're like horse ones. She's been hugging her. Whoa. They have wings, right? No, uh, they're the riders, I think. Oh, I thought there were wings on them. Let's go! That sounded bad. That was bad. And the demigods began to fall. Okay. Starting with Godwin the Golden. Oh. Oh no, he got he got crawlies. Corrupted. Oh. Yeah. Queen ah. America was driven to the brink. That. Turn into a werewolf. The shattering ensued a war that wrought only darkness. The Elden Ring was broken. Whoa. But by whom? You got a big sword. Why? Is it a sword? It looks like it's wrapped or something. I don't know what else it could be. Is it like a Deku tree? It looks like it has a, a face. Like a world tree. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a big tree. Yeah. That's a big walking thing. It's a lot of things you have to kill. Looks like Dragon Age. Maybe they're friendlies. <laughs> What could the demigods ever hope to win by boring? Wow. It's a big sword. It's a cool shot. There's a lot of big, cool things. It's got a prosthetic arm or something. The conqueror of the star. Whoa. Is force pull those? Magnets. Jeez. Whoa. The blade of Nickel and the Lady of the Seven. These two were the mightiest to remain, and locked horns in combat. Oh! Wow! Nice catch. <laughs> Good job, Nero. I feel like they've done that trick before. Why are you stabbing yourself? But there would be no victor. What in the world? It's a Bulbasaur. And it's like an explosion or something. It's a stylized explosion. We inhabit a fractured world. Awaiting the arrival of the Elder Brothers. Unless, of course, thou shouldst take the crown. Oh, that's cool. She's gonna look like a doll, doesn't she? She had like another face over here. Elden Ring. February 25th. Okay. It's not far. It's no. not at all. It gives me no time to finish Arceus. No. <laughs> I really like the uh, 
I like yes, four. Hmm. And Xbox. I like the yeah. the part when like the arm gets cut off and they just catch the Catches, sword. Catch the blade. I, I don't know if the blade got broken, and that's why they were like using themselves to push, push in. Yeah, yeah, maybe because it. I wasn't sure what happened there, but I, I love the the catch and stuff too. But yeah, um, there was a gameplay trailer that came out. I don't think we covered it on the channel, but it did come out. Um, I mean, I feel like it has some kind of like. Dark Soulsy feels as far oh, yeah. as like combat and stuff. Yeah. So. Yeah, there's just seem to be a lot more like quicker traversal because the areas seem to be much bigger. Sure. Like mm-hmm. mounts. And it seems much more like not that there's no story in like what I've played of like Dark Souls, but it's not as like prevalent. Prominent. Yeah. There's, there's a lot of environmental storytelling. Yeah. So you get a lot of that, and then there's like when you talk to some people, sometimes they'll tell you some little things and stuff, but you don't really get a full picture necessarily. Like, when I finished Dark Souls, uh, my Twitch chat was like, watch this video to understand what's going on. And I was like, all right. <laughs> no, I really like that about Dark Souls, where it's just sort of, it provides an atmosphere and a mood. And I feel like, I don't know how intentional it is and how much of it is, like, translation, but they don't tell you a lot. Sure. And I feel like that uh, they don't tell you a lot in story but they also don't tell you a lot in gameplay mechanics either yeah true. and there's just a lot of like discovery and things and i do really enjoy that <clears throat> so I, I hope that's not completely missing from this sure uh but a little more detailed guidance in the story would not be a bad thing either yeah sure like i do like in um some like environmental storytelling and stuff one thing i w- really enjoyed was left for dead they have like a they have a loose story in their like campaigns of what you're doing but the thing I really liked is that when you looked around at the environments and the locations you go through and the safe houses you're in, it's like little story bits of things you're seeing where it's like, you know, Sam, follow us. We're heading here. And then later on, you might find another one where it's like, Sam, sorry, we're not going to make it, you know. And, like, they are talking to someone that you don't know, but yeah. you're kind of getting their story. Yeah. Um, uh, Last of Us kind of did a little bit of that, too, where, like, sure. you find letters and stuff, and you're kind of following a story narrative. But like Resident Evil's done that a lot and I, for a long time. I like that. Like I think that's kind of neat. Where like when you're looking around, you find extra stories. It's not necessarily pertinent to your story. Yeah. But there's extra things in the world that you're building. And it builds the mood. Yeah, I think that's really cool and stuff too. Though Dark Souls, I feel like doesn't quite do that. But there is like little bits of lore and stuff in places and, and like uh, in items. Sometimes you'll like read an item mm-hmm. and it tells you a little bit about the item and that kind of fits in with some lore stuff of like the princess once had this and da 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 or something, you know. So, but uh, no, I think it looks really neat. It's not that far off either. No, it's not. Mm-hmm. I'm surprised that there's going to be a PS4 version. I wonder when like the cutoff will be. You know? For like new when PS4 stop. Games and stuff. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. I, I know I didn't do Cyberpunk any favors. Trying to develop for both. Sure. Yeah. How how long has PS4 been out? I know back in the day, PlayStation was like, we're going for 10-year ten lifespans of our consoles. Yeah. Uh, that was for PS2, PS2 definitely. I want to say PS3 might have done that. Maybe. Um, but I don't know about PS4. And I know other companies have not necessarily gone with that kind of idea. They're just like, well, we're done now. You know, Nintendo just kind of cuts off when they want to cut off or starts when they want to start. So yeah. yeah. But no, I think it looks really good and I'm interested to, to at least play a little bit kind of see what I think of it see if it fits into like what I'm thinking it's going to be mm-hmm. yeah interesting but, uh, stuff we may be having someone play it over on Twitch whether it's me Rick I don't know Calvin I don't know if that's your kind of game or not you, the closest you played to a Dark Soulsy game I think so far has been like Jedi Fallen Order yeah so which was really good it was it was really good those playthroughs are over there on the archive channel as well Yes, it's true. So, so yeah, maybe we'll play it. Uh, we'll probably have some announcements on that at some point whenever it comes out. I know I'm going to be in the middle of Arceus probably when it comes out because that yeah. comes out at the end of January and this comes out end of February. February. Yeah, and I'll only have a few streams of Arceus, so we'll see yep. who gets to we hop stream on this one. But... Like six days a week. Yes. So indeed, check it out. Guys, thanks so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe. We have more Game Award trailers coming out here on the channel. Um, if you haven't seen the one that you want yet, it's probably on its way. Just uh, bear with us. Give us a little bit of time. Subscribe. We'll have that up. Make sure you check out the description, Twitch, our archive channel. All that stuff should be down there. And uh, we'll see you guys later.